I want to say something in front of this little lady because we're coming to the end of a long, long tour. We started in August of 93, and it now qualifies as the longest tour in British country music history. Three years, 500 performances of Patsy Cline. The 500th one will be in Leeds next uh, Friday or Saturday night, I think. And I want to say that it's been a privilege and an honor and a joy to travel with one of the greatest singers I've ever heard, not just country singers, but just a great, great vocalist. I, l I worked with Patsy Cline in the 50s and at the Grand Ole Opry on tours in the 60s. I knew Patsy. She was a friend of mine. And this little gal over here from the west coast of Ireland is the closest I've seen and heard to Patsy in all those years. She's her equal in every Thank way. You. Thank fantastic. you very much. I'm going to celebrate by having a drink of water. Well, George, it's been a real honour for me, seeing as he's been nice to me. Sure, I'll be nice to him. For a chat, yeah. I've been travelling with George for three years, on and off, and it's been fantastic. But if I had known in the beginning that we had to share a car, there would have been no contract. You're not going to tell me about them roundabouts. I'll tell you, have you any of you hear about his driving? I, I'm going to take out extra insurance policies. He drives straight out onto the roundabouts. The excuse being that they don't have them in America. And once he gets out there, he stops to read the signs. So as we speak, somebody's working on a tribute to Sandy Kelly. I know they are. You and I can share. It almost took your line together to play old friends do. I want to thank Sandy for taking time out of her busy morning, which she would have been spent. Sitting. I'd have been sleeping. <laughs> she tends to sleep in in the morning. Irish people do, don't they? Yeah, yeah. I think so. Yeah. Do you have a, um, I, I'm kind of springing this on him now and he'll kill me. Do you have uh, the chart for crazy? I sure do. You do? Because a couple of people wanted to hear crazy. Is that all right? Yeah. I'm going to be honest and with you. 
Roger Reddig is here this morning. He's a great guitar player. And uh, he's the music director of Crazy, and I'm going to be really embarrassed to play this in front of Roger Reddick. So, how about a hand for Roger Reddick over there, one of the world's greatest guitarists. Roger's here with us. And also, Gareth Rowan is here as well. He is in, great. From the Patsy Klein musical. Gareth, you're somewhere out there, I know. Good to have well, this you. is a special request. He waffles, doesn't he? Yeah. He waffles. Oh, and takes him so long to say anything. Can you believe this type of a... We're going to do a birthday request for George. That's why I wanted him to stop talking. Because it's his birthday next Friday. And he's celebrating his 58th birthday. 59, I was trying to be kind. 59th birthday, and also he's celebrating 40 years in country music. Oh. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear George. Happy birthday to you. And we're going to bring back a special little friend. Is Susan still back there? And Susan's going to sing crazy with me. This is something we kind of put together. Wasn't she wonderful? Wasn't she wonderful? My grandfather told me when I was very young, I started singing when I was three years old. He said, one thing I'm going to tell you your whole life, 